Hey there, this is Michelle Pesco Salido, and in today's quick training video, I want to show you how you can create a video ad slideshow. So this is something that Facebook has just recently rolled out since making this video as of today. So depending on when you're watching this video, this may be a feature that's already been out for a while, but I want to walk you through the process of how you create this video slideshow. So this is very different than just doing a video in front of the camera and you know how you scroll through your newsfeed and you may see somebody who's uploaded a video. Well, this is actually a slideshow with images. So for those of you that don't necessarily like to do videos or you're concerned like I am that people are just scrolling through the newsfeed and the video is auto playing and they're not really stopping and, and watching the video or they can't unmute it because they're in a, a place where, you know, if they play the, the video, everybody around them is going to hear it. Or maybe they're in a loud place and they're scrolling through their newsfeed and they can't hear the video, period. This is a great way to actually use images and then you can also add some text to those images just as long as it doesn't take up 20% of the image space and uh, use that. So more information can be found over here and I'll put the link below the video, facebook.com forward slash business forward slash news forward slash slideshow. So basically, I mean, this is how it's gonna look. You can see how these images are sliding through and it's gonna do that automatically. And you can decide how long you want the, uh, the video image ad to go for. I'll show you that in a second as I walk you through me actually trying to create one. Um, but again, it's gonna play just like a video on autoplay. Nobody has to click any arrows or anything to make that happen. So um, if you wanna get a little bit more information, you can come here to find that out, but I'm actually gonna walk you through that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create an ad and there are a couple of areas here that you can actually choose. You, if you want to choose the objective to um, promote your page, you know, get more video views, send people to your website, increase conversions on your website, you can use the, uh, the video slideshow option here. Okay, so I'm going to just create a new likes ad is what I'm going to do. So I'm going to come over here and promote my fan page. I'm going to go ahead and choose my fan page here. And um, I would end up going through, if I were setting up this likes ad, I would set up the audience that I actually wanted to target uh, this ad to, to get more fans. So I might want to target age range, you know, uh, let's say, you know, 35 to 65 or 35 to 60. And maybe I want to target only women. And um, I might come in here and, you know, target people in the entrepreneurship industry or I might target a, an author or speaker. Everybody's going to be different in here. And, and if you want more extensive training on really how to create your audiences, I do have a course for that. This is more of just a quick tutorial just to really show you how this works. So you're going to come down to this section here and what you're going to want to choose is select video, not images, but video. And then if you have this available, you'll click on create a slideshow. And here's where you can upload different images. So you can do seven images. So I might do this one. So this is our fan page. So I'm gonna do a bunch of pictures of Bill and I. Um, and you can also do stock images. Just make sure they're high definition images. And that's why I like to use the stock images. And we have a bunch of images already uploaded in our image library. But if you wanna upload your own image, you're just gonna click on upload images and you can get those images uploaded. Um, so once you've chosen those, you can choose you know three or you can choose five or you can choose seven images. Once you do that, you're gonna click confirm right here. And then you can choose the total length. So maybe you want this to go for 15 seconds, or maybe you want it to go for seven seconds. Go ahead and choose that. You can actually have a transition, which is basically how your slides show switches from one image to the next. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and choose fade. And then from there, you click on create slideshow and it's gonna take between 30 seconds and two minutes, but it looks like it's going really fast. And then from there, you're gonna be able to see how that slideshow looks down here in the ad preview. Uh, again, you can create this slideshow in most of the ads that are available on Facebook. Um, I love it, I think it's a great idea. You know, for those of you that don't wanna do video, or like I said earlier, you're a little fearful of the fact, do people really listen to those videos in the mobile device? But here it is. So this is gonna automatically play in the uh, newsfeed if we were to actually, I don't know if I can preview it from here. I can't preview it from here, but you can see how it's gonna look and it's gonna automatically play and it's gonna go through all those images, 
Obviously, I would write some text above here for this ad and copy. Uh, again, you know, if you need some more training on Facebook, I have an amazing course. It's my flagship course that teaches you everything from A to Z on basically how to take any passion you have and turn it into a money-making business. So I hope you got a lot of value from this video. I'm pretty excited about this new feature. I hope you are too. Um, if you did get some value, be sure to share this. And uh, wherever you are, share this with your friends, share this with your work, your, your, your co-workers or business partners. And uh, leave me a comment below and I'll see you in the next training video. Bye-bye.